Good morning you guys, it's Karen and I thought I would come and do a quick review of this. This is the Natural Moisturising Factors Plus Beta Glucan. So it is the third offering in the Natural Moisturising Factors um, creams from The Ordinary. This one is um, a lower, lower price than the last one. So you've got the three. You've got the, the original, which is the Natural Moisturising Factors Plus Hyaluronic Acid. That one is £9.90 for 100ml. Um, that's one that I really enjoy and it's the perfect kind of level of moisture. I use it as a night cream. Then they came out with the Natural Moisturising Factors Plus Phytoceramides, which is more for drier skin. And that one is £20 for 100ml versus the £10, so double the price. But it is very moisturizing i did a review on that and i found that that was too much for my face i just i felt it was too rich but i thought i thought and think it's great as a neck cream um and then they've come out with this one which is the natural moisturizing factors plus beta glucan and this in, is more directed towards people with oily skin and um, this one is 12 pounds so a bit more on the um reasonable price range i know a lot of you weren't happy with the 20 pound I think £12 is a really good price for this 100ml tube. Um, so let me tell you what they are saying about this quickly. It is just a gel, let me show you. I'm surprised at how much of a gel it actually is. Like you can see it is clear. And a lot of, a lot of things that claim to be a gel, I always expect them to be transparent and to be a gel but then you open it and it's like a milky gel or it's like, it feels just like a cream, but you put it on and you're like, okay, it's got a bit of a gel-like substance, subsistency, but this is actually a gel. And when I had really badly oily skin years ago, I would have just, I was crying out for something like this, something that would give me some hydration, but that was, you know, good for my oily skin. So this goes on and it dries down fairly quickly. Um, I was concerned about this being no, let me tell you about the claims. I was going to tell you the claims, wasn't I? And then I went off. It's just because I saw a picture of it, the translucent gel. Um, it says that it's a lightweight gel moisturizer designed to provide all day hydration after just one application, which it does, formulated with natural moisturizing factors, beta glucan and ceramides, and works to help strengthen the skin barrier. Um, it's suitable for all skin types, including sensitive. Due to its lightweight gel texture, may be especially suited to oily and combination skin. Beta glucan is something that is known to help um, protect the skin barrier and also soothe irritation and, and redness and sensitivity. Um, so it's a really good ingredient. And do you remember I had the Ionic Beta Glucan Serum and I loved it. I actually loved that on my neck as well because I found that it was, when I was using that underneath my moisturizer, my neck was much more hydrated. Um, so yeah, I was interested in this, but I thought, I thought it wasn't going to be hydrated enough. I just thought with my skin now, um, is nowhere near as oily as it used to be. Still controlled by um, medication, but I still do get oily days. Um, but I also get dry, dry, tight feeling skin. You know, I can get some dry patches, not so much now. No, I don't use any kind of retinol or retinol products, um, but it, it can feel really, really tight if I don't have something that's moisturizing enough. And there are things that I have used um, that make it feel like that, even from the ordinary, the ordinary sun protection products, I can't use them because they just make my skin feel tight. So to be honest, I thought I'm gonna try this and probably I'll be like, no, I can't use it on its own. I'll need to use some kind of serum underneath it or something like that. But I used it and my skin felt really, really hydrated. It feels lovely going on because it's that gel. It just feels very, soothing and especially I feel like like I said back when I had oily skin I had really bad acne as well I think it's an it's going to be a nice product for you if you fall into that category I mean even if you've got dry skin as well but particularly that category because if I had like a breakout on my chin and I was putting on a cream cream I just felt like oh god am I going to make this worse you know but for somehow putting something like a gel moisturizer on would give me comfort you know would feel like I wasn't I don't know why I don't know if that's just psychological but I think that this is something that people with oily acne prone skin are going to love um, and I think sensitive skin will love it too and like I said actually for me I've got more dehydrated skin that can feel tight and this didn't make it feel tight at all it was absolutely fine and I used it just on its own nothing else underneath it just to see how I got on now I have only used it a couple of times um, because I'm testing out the number seven future renew range and so I just actually used it for two days before I started the number future 
Renew range and then realized that I hadn't tried this just on its own um, and so I used it as a night cream one night so I probably need to use it a lot more to confirm that it continues to to make my skin feel hydrated you know because sometimes if you use something I don't know say for a week or two and then suddenly you're like you know what my skin started to feel a bit dry it's not been hydrating as much as I thought I am going to use this instead of the original natural moisturizing factors this one is only two pound more I'm happy to pay that and use this as a night cream on my face um, and then the one with the phytoceramides ceramides on my neck um, the reason being is simply for me I've don't like hyaluronic acid it's not something that's ever done anything for my skin um, I don't mind that it's in the natural moisturizing factors but I prefer the ingredient beta glucan and this is something that I feel has given me more moisture to my skin both in the ionic serum and also in this so yeah so so far I really love it let me know what your thoughts are I'll leave details of all my makeup etc in the description and I'll speak to you again soon